This is going to be the new dining room and that fire wall is going to be coming out so it'll be a new kitchen diner all the way through. We have knocked the wall down, put the steel up in the ceiling as discussed and now we've started on the extension. So this area originally uh, had a small extension garage that was open to the elements. It was knocked down and was the old uh, side entrance into the building. From the original building we had a conservatory, a very small conservatory and a bay window which the client felt wasn't big enough for what he wanted. Due to the fact we had a bigger area to use, the bay window and conservatory was taken down and from that a timber frame extension was designed which is on two floors. So on the ground floor we have a twin garage and an orangery. Once we've got a design for the timber frame, we have to have a slab put down. From the slab, the timber frame gets erected. And then from that, the flat roof then goes on that. From that, we then have the first storey. We managed to reclaim and save a lot of the original bricks which have now been used on the outside brickwork to keep in keeping with the original uh, property. Once the timber frame panels have been put up on the first floor, we're then ready to put the roof on. Uh, the design of this roof was very different from many roofs that we usually do due to the fact the client wished to have uh, a room within the roof space. So to enable us to do this, we decided with uh, the design team to design a roof that was made of glue lambs. The glue lambs were very big, which has to be outsourced out of the country. They were over 460 by 200 uh, in depth and height. From each one of those, we had to lift them in by crane due to the fact they weighed over 860 kilos each. As you can see here, we're now in the orangery. So this is all finished now. Ready, uh, the first fix for the electricians is all done. Uh, so we're really ready for plasterboarding and insulation now. Uh, you can see above us that we have the uh, orangery roof, which is glass, which does enable a lot of light into quite a large living area. Through here, if we come through, we then come into a very large double garage, which uh, is also ready for uh, the second fix for uh, the plasterboarding and basically to be finished. And if we come up here, this takes us up to the first floor. And from here, you can actually see the A-frames which we craned in from the road and put them onto the timber frame. And as you can see, just the sheer size of them and uh, where the client does have the opportunity to have uh, another room above. Here we have uh, some very large patio doors which give a gorgeous view of Tennyson Down. You can see the top of the orangery roof here. And also the client will then have through here, knocked through to get through to the existing uh, property so we can gain access to this part of the new extension. So when we're actually finished here, and this is all finished, this will be the client's gymnasium, which I hope he will enjoy, and it will be a fine addition to an absolutely gorgeous house the client is having built.